In this video you're going to see how to connect the guest account to a wireless network. In Windows 8.1 you go to desktop, then move the mouse pointer to the left, to the right bottom corner, click on settings, then on the network icon, then, show, then connect to your wireless network. Provide a password if necessary. then you are connected to the internet. Okay, now let's see how to do this on Windows 8.0. Um, on Windows 8.0 we don't have the, the option to click here on the network icon and see the wireless networks for some reason so we have to find another way to connect the guest account to uh, the internet on Windows 8.0. Uh, some considerations that we have to take on Windows 8.0 is that if another user has already set up a network connection and not configured that connection to connect automatically to the internet, the guest account will not be able to connect to throat that profile to the internet. Instead we have to uh, choose another pro net wireless profile or delete that profile and then recreate that profile to connect to that profile from the guest account. If another user has already set up a wireless profile and, s and configured that profile to connect automatically to the internet, then the guest account will be automatically connected to the to the internet. So let's see how to connect the guest account on Windows 8.0. Uh, press Windows plus X, then go to control panel, then go to network and internet, then go to network and sharing center, then go to set up a new connection or network, then click on manually connect the, to a wireless network, Now to see which uh, wireless profiles are available you have to use the command prompt. Open the command prompt and enter the following command net sh space vlan space show space networks. From that command you can see the, the available available net uh, wireless profiles on your area. Um, so this one is the one I want to connect to. If you want to see more details than this listed you can use the same command except with mode equals BSSID then we, you will have detailed information on, on the wireless profiles on your area. <coughs> you can see the encryption type at uh, CCMP means that this is a AES encryption. Here you can see the signal strength, the technology used, this, the wireless speeds um, supported. So I want to connect to to the Hangover SSID because this, this is the only one I know the password. <coughs> okay, I type in Hangover in options. Uh, I can see that is it is VPA2 personal. The security key I already know. I'm gonna make this. Click on next. Now we will run into pro into a problem. Uh, a network called Hangover already exists. And like I said previously, if uh, another user has already set uh, had set up this the same network profile and not configured it to, to connect automatically, the guest account will not be able to connect to that wireless profile unless he deletes the the profile and recreates it, or he connects to one 
to another network profile like one of these but I only know the password of hangover so I have to delete the the hangover um, wireless profile before I can con actually connect to it so to to delete the hangover profile you will enter an other command or net sh space vlan uh, delete profile name equals now you you put your uh, wireless profile in the one that you want to delete in my case I want to delete the hangover profile okay I type enter okay now it's gone what I have to do can I do now is uh, boost this existing network okay now now I'm gonna check if I'm connected to the internet No, I'm not, um, because I have to redo the process, set a new connection, uh, connect manually to a wireless network. Now that is is deleted, I have to recreate it. Oh, sh Okay, I'm gonna close now and check if I'm connected to the internet from the guest account. Okay, we are connected. We are. We are connected to the internet. Uh, if you want to check if you are really connected to the internet, you can, you can do net VLAN show uh, interface. Then it would show. Uh, the state connected and the blah, 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 the profile is hangover Windows 7 is basically the same as Windows 8.0 you connect through the con control panel uh, network and internet network and sharing center then go to set up a new connection or network manually connect to a wireless network next uh, to see the networks you open a command prompt net vlan show networks mode equals bssid type enter I mean press enter then you can see the um, the networks the available networks if you are guessing what convidado means, it means guest in Portuguese Brazil. This is was originally a Portuguese Brazil language Windows that I changed to English language. So to connect we proceed as before shown. Um, The difference between Windows 7 and Windows 8 is that uh, there is no not a limitation that when another user has already set up a, a wireless profile but not uh, configured it to connect automatically, you can you have to first delete the the wireless profile and then recreate it. You can just connect it uh, by specifying the the SSID and the other settings, security type, encryption type, security key and then when you cre uh, create this then you will be able to connect to the internet okay I'm already connected here that's how you connect to uh, by with the get guest account by using Windows 7. Okay, I guess that's it and thank you for watching the video.